SJNY Libraries – Evaluating Websites In this video, we will learn several techniques that we can use to evaluate the credibility of a website. Students today commonly use the Internet to conduct scholarly research in addition to using the more traditional subscription-based databases. While there are many advantages to using the Internet, there are disadvantages as well. Some pros of using the Internet include the vast amount of information available, the ease at which you can find this information, and that it is often free to access. Some cons of using the Internet include the lack of coherent organization, the ability for anyone to create a page that appears credible, and the alarming number of pages that purposely present misinformation. So how can we tell the good from the bad, the real from the fake? So to evaluate any website, you should consider five criteria – authority, accuracy, currency, relevance, and purpose. For authority, you want to consider the URL and analyze what type of organization published the site. Was it a .edu site, .gov, .org, or .com? You want to look at the page and who the author or the publisher of the source is. You want to consider, is the author qualified to write on this topic? And is there contact information available for the author? For accuracy, you want to look at if the information is supported by any evidence. Has the information been reviewed or peer-reviewed? Can you verify the information on other sources? Are there any spelling or grammatical errors? Currency. When was the page created or last updated? Are there any broken links that could indicate an old or stale page? Does your topic require current information? If so, you want to pay close attention to the currency of the information that you're citing. Relevance. Does the information relate to your topic? And who is the intended audience? Is the information at an appropriate level for your needs? Is the website geared for K-12 through or for college level? Do the links lead to other reputable sites? And finally, purpose. What's the purpose of the site? Are they trying to inform, entertain, sell, or persuade? And you should always ask yourself, why was this written and for whom? Is the point of view objective or impartial? Are there any biases in the writing on the page? Is advertising clearly differentiated from the informational content? I hope that this video helps to guide you in evaluating websites for use in your academic research, but I also highly recommend that you take a look at the additional resources included in the description section below for a deeper dive into this topic. Thank you for your attention.